I think it is called nest because the aliens are inside of it in the nest. Hello everyone, it is crazy Riven and today I am trying to be quiet. I'm hiding in my office because with my Christmas hat on because in 2016 it is almost the new year you know the internet of things is coming it is scary the internet of things is after us so I have my Christmas hat and I'm hunkering down for a winter sleep hiding away from the internet of things whoa okay stay up there dude this this Christmas had this very opinionated about where it wants to go it has like five-year plan or something <sighs> okay let's let's turn this way is, is this better are you happy now no okay it's like I, I'm doing like ghetto thing like yo yo what is up I'm a famous rapper I can wear whatever I want you know so anyway Internet of Things is scary because you know what that means, right? Have you seen any of the news of Internet of Things? It is where all the things get on the internet and they take over your refrigerator. This is where like your washer and dryer tell your fridge, hey, this guy, he has dirty clothes, don't give him a sandwich. And then your treadmill talks to your fridge and says, um, this guy is sweaty and he has been working out, but he's he's fat. So don't give him any, anything to eat, especially no sugar, because sugar tried to kill you. So anyway, Internet of Things, though, could be useful. So if you're watching, you know, like the Super Bowl on your TV, then Internet of Things could tell the TV, Hey, can you make a sandwich? Tell tell the fridge to make a sandwich for me. So when I am hungry, I go in the fridge is like, Here you go very much, sir. Here's your sandwich. I hope you are happy. M Maytag is happy to be of service or whatever the brand. I don't know. I just heard Maytag was cool or something. So, Internet of Things is coming. And it's already here. Some of the things are very spooky, like... Like the thermostat, it turns the heat off when you're not there. Well, it turns it down when you're not there. It is called a nest. I think I think it is called nest because the aliens are inside of it in the nest. So it is a nest of aliens, and they are trying to take over your house. This is serious. You spend a lot of hundreds of thousands of monies because you make the big, get the big house you can, and then the aliens take over because they turn down your heat for you. It's like we will do it for you. We will help you out, huh? -huh. So then they turned your heat down, and your your whole house is cold, and then your fridge is like blah, 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 until you get home. Then it's like nothing happened. Nope, didn't do anything. Nothing happened all day. We did not do anything. It is just fine and good and warm in here. Very sneaky suspicious if you ask me. That nest is bad news, man. I'm trying to think if there's a good reason to have Internet of Things. Some Italian guy named Arduino is coming after you. And then there is... All kind of, all kind of guys. What is the? Uh, oh yeah, raspberry Pi. What if I don't like raspberry Pi? What if I want like blackberry Pi? I don't want every pie to be raspberry. And you know what? To be frank, frank, honest with you, I cannot eat pie because I'm diabetic. Okay. <sighs> I like pie though. Mrs. Riven made a very nice. Like sugar free pie for me when we had uh, Thanksgiving, you know, it was pumpkin pie. And uh, it is so pumpkin, I'm telling you what, it could have its own rock band that was so pumpkin. And then anyway, it didn't have any sugar, so it was very good. So I like that pie, it's so good. 
um but you know I don't like Raspberry Pi because they take over the world. Have you not been listening to me? So, yeah, anyway. I'm hoping that the Internet of Things is a good idea. But we will see. I mean, you know, Apple Watch did not go over so well. So, you know, Apple Fridge and Apple Tree and stuff will probably not be good either. It'll be scary. And all the things will talk to all the other things. So... Like, you know, if you're at the airport and then the scanners at the airport are connected to Internet of Things, then they will say, Oh, <laughs> your fridge, did you know that they look like naked? I'm never flying again. Um, because, you know, I don't want my fridge to know what I look like without clothes on. That is not cool. I want my fridge to just give me a freaking diet soda, that's all. I don't want, you know, all my vital statistics, you know, with the, with the, whoa, there we go, okay, hold on, let me get my other, my other Christmas present I got hat here, make, make, make sure the eyebrow can breathe there a little bit, okay, that's better, okay, so, like I was saying, I did not want all my vital statistics to like, you know, like, like the bump, 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 the thumpy thump and your heart rate and stuff. I don't want all my appliances knowing that. What business does my, you know, washer and dryer have knowing what is going on in my heart valves? That, that is security issue. That is privacy. It is like your own personal NSA with the dryer sheets. It is like Danny Bear will take your information and tell the world. <laughs> I, I think Facebook already knows, but anyway, so you get the point. I don't want, you know, the smart toilet telling me, Hey man, you maybe want to lay off the diet soda for a while. No, that should not happen ever, never. So, the Internet of Things has scary implications of implementations. I, I rhymed. Did you see that? I, I'm doing better with the rhyming. So, and, you know, Internet of Things is spooky. Spooky not at a distance like Einstein said. It is spooky up close like this. It is spooky right here, you know. So, anyway... Internet of Things is creepy. That is why I'm wearing the Stormtrooper hat. You see? You see? It is it is menacing because of the pom-pom, you know. Hashtag menacing pom-pom. Anywho, so when the Internet of Things hits, uh, you better run, run for the hills uh, with your tail between your legs and your shotgun out, you know, ready to go. So, because right before Internet of Things takes over, um, you know, if you get a lot of canned food, then you'll survive the zombie apocalypse. But, uh, you know, Internet of Things is freaky business. So, if you have any ideas about how to stay safe in the Internet of Things apocalypse, uh, you know, let me know down there in, in, the, in, the, in the, the ready box. You know, comments, that's what it is. That word is so hard sometimes. Comments. It sounds kind of like communist, you know, which is what Internet of Things is all about, of course. So, anyway, um, I, I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Um, please stay safe out there. Don't let your fridge know that you're fat. And um, I hope to see you next time. I hope I hope you will watch my next video and not get eaten by your TV. So. Happy New Year. <laughs> I feel like 789 encoded in binary on the Windows logo on the front of a Microsoft employee that works in the Windows department. See, my turkey head is all excited too. That basically is definitive proof that 7 did 8 9. If you are 6. If you are Windows 6 from the past, be very, very afraid. Because 789. Boom.